Good morning. You ever wake up and your mouth feels like sandpaper? Oh no. I need to go to the water store. But you know we gotta get a run in first. Here. Can I go on my run? Come on, go on my run, okay, buddy? I'll be right back. <laughs> I'll be right back, okay? There has been an insane amount of construction going on on our highways right now. Two miles in 20 minutes. Like I said, don't stop running. It takes forever to get back. Water is important. The reason I'm talking about water is because I've had a couple friends ask me why I go through the hassle of going in and picking up and buying water at the store. You use it every day. Drink water. Okay, so I'm out in Sugar House right now, another part of Salt Lake City. Now, apparently, I gotta find this place, and it's on the second story of a building, so let's go on an adventure and try to find it. I think I found it. That wasn't too bad. Now I'm starting to think I parked in the wrong parking lot. So I'm wondering if my car's still gonna be there. We'll find out. Oh, that's bright. Now the moment of truth. Moment of truth. Oh, she's still there. Drink water. So this big old building back here, I have no idea what that is. Looks huge. Let's take a look. Had to swing by here for a second to get a couple shots in real fast. Oh. 
We made it. Hey wife. Hi. Um, do we have a pot that I could like boil a ton of water in and you know that create that gross slime that's left over? Or do I have to go to the DI and buy a pot? Uh you might have to go to the DI and buy a pot. To the DI to buy a pot. Here. So the DI is actually a thrift shop here in Salt Lake City that a lot of people go to. They actually didn't have pots here, but I got me a new snowboard helmet. Ha! And now to savers. Savers. This is our day. I got the pot. So what I'm doing with the pot is I'm gonna boil a bunch of water in it. One to two, three gallons maybe tops. And then you'll see what's left over inside the pot after all the water has boiled out of it and evaporated. And you'll see why I don't drink tap water anymore. Did you know your body is made up of 55 to 75 percent water? All this white gross stuff in here, that's what you're drinking all the time when you drink tap water. So this right here, this is what I decided to scrape out of the pan before I decided to give up. But this stuff right here is what's in your water that you drink all the time. But then you're probably asking me, what is that stuff? Well, let's start with this, mercury. Being exposed to levels of mercury over a period of time can cause kidney damage. VOCs, volatile organic compounds. When these elements end up in your drinking water and is heated or vaporized, aka showers, your body can absorb these contaminants. Huh. Pharmaceuticals, basically by people flushing their pills or their prescriptions incorrectly and not disposing of them properly, and then them ending up in your drinking water. Herbicides can interfere with the body's hormonal and reproductive organs. Fluoride. 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 Too much fluoride can lead to dental fluorosis or skeletal fluorosis, which can damage bones and joints, as well as neurological problems. I don't know about you, but I want this to work properly. I'm just gonna ramble on a list on just fluoride. Acne and other skin problems, cardiovascular problems, including osteoporosis, arteral calcification, high blood pressure, cardiac insufficiency, and heart failure. Reproductive issues such as lower fertility. All I'm trying to say is, drink clean water. Okay, so she's claiming it was an accident. <laughs> But, my coffee filters sit up here. When I make coffee, I grab said filters, grab box, put down on counter. I guess she rigged the box to be able to open and me just grab it. But forgot to tell me, where is it? Oh yeah. She put this. This is a sharpening stone you use to sharpen your knives. Yeah, bam, me, her, accident. Oh, shush. And in process of stone falling and hitting me in head, comes off head. It's busted, bud. What do you have to say for yourself? It was an accident. I 